Flu season is on our doorstep, and H1N1 is the strain you can expect to come knocking. But the BC Centre for Disease Control says we might be on course to get off easy compared to last year. Typically, the flu circulates between November and April, but for the past few seasons, sporadic detections had been showing up earlier than usual and were followed by some pretty severe flu seasons. That's, that's not the case this year. Uh, we're having about five to ten times less of those sporadic detections uh, this year compared to last year. Also last year we saw more H3N2 circulating, which tends to be harder on the overall population, especially the elderly, versus H1N1, which tends to hit middle-aged people hardest rather than the elderly or young people typically see more hospitalizations and more deaths during H3N2 epidemics. Now we may still see some H3N2 and H1N1 is no picnic. The recommendation continues to be to get a flu shot. But of course, the question is who among us will heed the warning? I always get a flu shot every year, yes. Absolutely. Probably. Does give you uh, the exact things that you need to fight the flu this year. There's also herd immunity, so people who can't get it don't end up getting the flu or other viruses. Do you think there are enough of us getting our flu shots? Uh, it doesn't sound like it, no. Statistics Canada says on a typical year, about a third of Canadians do get vaccinated for the flu. In Vancouver, David Zura, City News.